Hello and welcome back to another episode of Shapeless Skyrim, our love letter to the Skyrim modding community. I'm Tori. I'm Tyler. Today we have three fantastic mods to show you. So join us in this in this big, big world that... Uh, this, this great big world that we can just get lost in, known as Skyrim. Yeah, exactly. Like, you know, when you think about it in the grand scheme of things, we're all so very small, and let's, let's explore this big world of Skyrim together. Of course. As always, the mods are in the description below, so let's get right into it. Tori, it's a great, big, blue, beautiful world out there. It is. How lovely. Why don't we just have kind of a look around and look at this. Holy, Holy Jesus, God. shit. Is that horse big? Oh, no. Wait. We're small. We're just tiny. <clears throat> We're just a little boy. We're a little boy in, in a great, big, horse-filled world. Tyler, welcome to mod number one, hot out of the gate. It is called Jurassic Skyrim by Adi PS4. Need a ride? In a world where playable characters are virtually the smallest things in existence and everything else is huge, your job is to survive amongst giants. The only problem? Everything is giant. So we're, so we're just a little guy. We are a little tyke, and if <laughs> I get on this horse... Yeah, just get, there we go. <laughs> just, <laughs> So basically, oh no, the horse is too big. So <laughs> it's got a low clearance on that on that sucker. Uh, basically, what this does is it makes you, the player character, and any any human character or whatever, like in any type of NPC that is your gender. So in our case, all males are the size of children now. The children aren't any smaller. We are just the size of children now. But every other living creature is much, much larger. I think two and a half times. It's big. Two to ten times larger. So they really went with it depending on the animal type. So you're still a little guy lost in a big old world of danger. Let me see if there's like a... Uh, we saw one male guard out there. but Yeah, yeah. Let You know what? Let's head inside, uh -oh. actually. Tyler, uh -oh. white one broke on us. Don't oh, see, no we broke white run. So let's fast travel inside, actually. <laughs> <laughs> so look at the uh, Adrian. Could we maybe um, I like that. could we maybe play with the swords? <laughs> why? So I don't understand why this is the case. But why are all the why are all the men little and why are the, the women regular size? still? Uh oh, oh, no. Now Braith can bully us. Oh God! I'm not afraid. Oh God! Get away from! I don't Braith. like that. She's got a little more meat on her bones than Jan does too, which is odd. And then Yasolda. Uh oh. Hey Tyler, Perfect. I think I found a big boy. <laughs> There's only one big boy that remains. Yeah, he's the one who does. Uh, he does take all the glory, and he does take all the women. Unfortunately. This is my wife in my playthrough. So yeah, I could just. She's like, I love, I love my beautiful. I love my little <laughs> six-year-old husband. My six-year-old husband is so brave and strong when he goes on adventures. I love him. And she does still breastfeed me, <laughs> by request, by by request. Yeah, it, it just looks so stupid. Like, <laughs> look at us like craning our neck up to, hey oh. honey, hey babe. It's is this what Kevin Hart um, feels like all the time? <laughs> um, Fralia. I'm looking to buy a necklace for my girlfriend here. God, we're so pathetic. I know. We just look so dumb going up to a table. Like, we, you can't see over it. Now, let's check out the uh, the wildlife mm. and ignore that thing behind it for don't now. Don't even look at that. that don't even exist. look. That is a big mo- Dude, you could just get down on, nope, on a knee. Don't and finish. No. Nope. I know where you're going. Don't. And fresh don't. milk. Uh, is that what you didn't want me to finish? Yeah. Oh, well. There's something so weird, like we we scaled down in such a way that we look skinnier than the children, and like God, the world That's is just so big now. Here. Uh huh. Bye. Looks like she's getting go down inside. on one knee. Like, do you wanna do you wanna go inside, sweetie? Would you like some milk and cookies, honey? Oh. Fuck you! I'm a man. <laughs> I'm a preteen now. No curfews for me. I wonder if Tommy's home. He's I hope so I don't get mauled by a Fuck. fucking chicken. Dude, that chicken is almost as tall, and it's sitting down. Oh, God. This is an unsettling reality to kind of be put into, huh? That chicken is as tall as gone. 
big boy. Who's a good dog? Hey, why'd they make the dogs in Skyrim so ugly, huh? Yeah, they could have been cute. They pick the ugliest, like, template, and they're like, every dog is that. Oh my god, skeevers are oh, our size. fuck. Are those regular skeevers, or are those mod number two skeevers? I don't know, it's not coming up with a name. Uh-oh. Uh, pretend like you didn't see that. Those were skeevers. Those, those were regular. Nothing else, don't even... Oh my god, even the butterflies. Are they? No fucking way. Look at how big it looks, Tori. Yeah, that's a pretty that's a pretty big bug. It's a whole new world for you to venture out into. Yeah. And there's a lot of things you can find that are very big. And yeah. you are you are just very little. So go yeah. out there and try and protect yourself against this you got honey I shrunk the kids. You did, yeah, you did get uh Look at that motherfucker. Fuck, that's a big fox. Good god. Everything is terrifying, but just remember, you, you're a preteen now, and nothing can stop you, and you have to be a man now. You have to be a man and be strong for your mom, <laughs> because dad left, and now you're the man of the house. God, I just hate standing next to a rock mm -hmm. and not being able to jump it. I know. It's like, oh, well, let me just, this kind of, fuck, can't quite, fucking can't shit. quite. And we still do have the super jump mod on. It's just, we're just such, we're such a little guy, we can't do it. Look at this. Look, your stature may be small, but your bravery is big, and never forget that. Tyler, should we get on to mod number two? We should get on to mod number two. Oh, that dragon's real big. That is the fucking enormous. God, they did make the dragons even bigger, didn't they? Yep. That's not great. So we're here at Froki's Shack. Over, yes, I'm going to show you where it is on the map. It's kind of tucked in the corner closest to Riften. Yeah, Riften and Iverstad, sort of. Iverstad. So it's tucked in this corner. Let me get rid of that map marker. Right there for you. And mod number two is called Sylvan Spirits, made by friend of the show, Scarecrow. So we're very excited, as always, to show off a Scarecrow mod. This was suggested to us by Non-Servium R. Thank you for that suggestion. And uh, we're going to start off this mod by getting a couple of the followers. There's five followers? No? Yeah, five followers and added. We're going we're gonna to pick up a couple of them. This is Holheim Shatterhand near yeah. Froki's Shack. Perfect. We got one follower. Now let's go get another. All right, Holheim. Hol All right, Hol Hulk. We're gonna. Careful. Yeah, he's Hol Hulk now. Yeah. He really just. He's a beefy boy. He's he may be small, but he's got, he's packed with meat. Let me assure you. And we're here at Witch Mitch Witch Mist Grove. For which, follower number two, which is just south of Windhelm. Yeah, it's a little tree icon, and we are looking for I guess I uh, scale dip. Ah, that looks like a fancy old tree right there, don't it? Oh, that's sick. That is, that looks like the Wall of Faces from Game of Thrones. That does. Shit, that's fucking rad, Scarecrow. Scarecrow, that's rad as hell. Scarecrow, Damn. you know what's not rad as hell though? Is that these are the only two followers we could find? We, we searched. Tried to, we for tried to find forty-eight minutes, Scarecrow. Forty-eight goddamn minutes. These are the only two that are. Ex I would say Scarecrow. If you if you would so let us suggest this. something Let's to you, be a little bit more specific in your description, uh, rather than like north of the roadside ruins. How far north? Like it barely varies. We could not find anyone anywhere. These are the only two. These are the only two, but we still love you. We still love you, and we still we still are. We don't respect this. you anymore. <laughs> you you lost that. You big lost time. that. You're gonna have to earn it back. Let's yeah. see how the rest of the mod goes. Mm -hmm. But we still love you. Yeah. And if the rest of the mod is good. If again, if the rest of the mod is good. Perfect. It's, and God, this is such a cool setting for a follower. Yes. Now, Tyler, I think we should take these new two followers uh, into battle, and I'll explain a little bit more about the mod. Okay, perfect. I knew there was more. All right, followers, we are off to Steam Crag Camp here. Yes, we are. Because there's a couple other things about the mod. Tori, would you mind explaining that? There are many, many other things. So Sylvan Spirits is a mod that brings the power of nature spirits to Skyrim. Players will encounter fearsome timber brides, savage fin tigure, and all manner of new animals. <clears throat> Uh, five new followers stand ready to join. New magic, weapons, and armor are available from the arsenal. <clears throat> so there's over a dozen new types of enemies 
like the Timber Bride, the Fin Tigers, and the Devoured Enemies, around a dozen new types of animals, including coyotes, rats, boars, and wildcats. We've come across like cave, cave lions. Cave lions. <clears throat> um, we got two new craftable sets of armor, six new craftable weapons, and around twenty new temperable pieces of equipment. Uh, and then two new crafting stations called the Ancient Cairns that have locations in Harmugstall and Steam Craig Camp, which is where we are headed right now. Okay, so this looks <clears throat> Hornwood Cairn, which is, I believe, is that one, one of, of the, the new crafting stations? Because it's nearby the, Steam one Craig of the ancient Camp. Cairns, maybe? Yeah. Yeah. That's the big... Hornwood Sentinel. Okay, so yeah, he is. And... He is one of the, like... Guardians. The guardians of the new... Look at how fucking... Dude, it's just like armor. He doesn't have a head in there. And it's like wooden looking. That's Fuck, fucking, that looks cool. That's fucking rad. Is that is that wooden stall rim? Is that what you did? No, dragon No, bone? wooden dragon... Oh! Oh, no, no, no. Those are fighting for us. Yeah, that's cool. One of our followers can summon weird, disgusting spiders. Well, yeah, I mean, her name is Isene, the Witch Primordial, so... She's got to be able to do some dope shit with a name like that. So now the Fuck, crafting station. So let me show you where I am on the map. Yeah. So just like south of Steam Crag Camp. What the hell? What? Hold on. What the hell icon is that? Uh, a new one. Did you make a new scarecrow? Maybe. Even if Even if you didn't make a new one and we're just dumb, just take credit for it. Just no take, one's going to second guess it. Just say you did it. So, I'm guessing there will be a crafting station nearby here. I, I think so. Do you have to go in anywhere? That's why I was trying to use ancient cairns. Oh, shit. oh, that's sick. Fuck yeah, let's do it. Elvin. Oh, you can make it, like the wooden looking shit. Oh, fuck, that's the sick. The god's wood mask. Which wood mask? Fuck. With the, the wooden... Uh, on the Forsworn, it really does... So, I'm sorry, Sil... When uh, worn by the shaman Holheim, this fetish imparts him with the divine spirit. So the Holheim. But I can't... I don't know what a spectral burl is. Oh, fuck. I need all these spectral burls and amber shards. Yeah, you can create... Which must come in the game You somewhere. can create amber by taking a spectral burr and some charcoal to a smelter. So those must be added in the game. Fuck me. This looks sick. I am super into that. That's got like some... Uh, what are those fucking... You didn't play The Witcher 3. God damn it, Tyler. There's like these... These... Uh, these like tree gods that you fight and it's like oh L fuck that's sick that's so sick scarecrow i am such a fan of this carved wood look you got going on yes this is honestly this is the fuck, coolest this. retexture i've ever seen i think it might be because it's it it has such a like a it, it feels natural in the game where it's like oh no these are nature spirits like they would use these very organic materials to have their fuck that's rad so where do where do you think we get Oh sweet. oh, sweet. Okay. Just take his shit. Fuck yeah. Put it on your very tiny body, Tyler. Fuck, that looks so good. Yeah. Yeah. Hold on. Give us like a little, give us a yep. little reveal here. Okay. Now they're also, I believe if you go to Steam Craig Camp, there should be something. Or is this what was by Steam Craig Camp? This is what was by Steam Craig Camp. And what I love knowing is that, um, I, does it say where to get the burls at all? It does oh, not say, a... but I would imagine... So the other thing this mod does is not only are these guardians at the, the different cairns and stuff like that, there's actually over a hundred new spawn points uh, that are in the world that generate the enemies from this, like all of the, the sylvan spirit type, uh, like organic nature spirit enemies across Skyrim. So I think you might be able to get them if you go find a... Like, go pick a fight with some nature spirits, Tyler. Okay. Tori, I just need you to look at how good this amber glass sword looks. It's fucking hot. Like, it's, I'm a bit aroused by that blade. Look at how good that looks. And, like, the wooden hilt. Mm. Fuck. That looks so fucking good, Scarecrow. Goddamn. I know Can, there's one you more. You really don't Karen. let us down, Scarecrow. No. That, but make, the, make them easier. To, make the followers Please easier make the find. followers easier to find. You really do. You, you kind of uh, dry, uh, shit the pooch on that one. Is that you, the phrase? You, you, you shit the bed. Or you screwed the pooch, not you shit the pooch. <laughs>
this fetish imparts him with the divine spirit of the forest. Tyler, so I want to create that. Yeah, I want to find this man's fetish. Put the necklace on him. <laughs> he likes the stairs. Oh, what? He's already got one. Cat's fetish. What? The savagery of the cat. Strength of the bear. Is this Cunning some, of the uh, fox. This, dude, this is some real furry shit, though, huh? Mm-hmm. Holheim Shatterhand. Does it give, like, a description of him? Oh, oh Scarecrow. Nice. Very nice. nice. That's a lot of reading that I'm not going to do right now, but we're, I love that you did we're it. We're saving that for you guys at home to have <laughs> yeah. fun with when you uh-huh. download a <laughs> smile for yourself. Yeah. Okay, and it's because he was near Froki's, like, uh, Froki's cabin or whatever that was called, Froki's shack. Mm-hmm. Froki is like described in the book. Like it's Oh, wait, and, and also he's talking about that wolf blood, like the wolf blood savages, which are from the mod, like we did an episode on it called Wolf Blooded. Remember yep. that? Damn that was, that Scarecrow. We also, we also made fun of furries on that episode a lot too, so we might just be digging at Scarecrow's soul here. God, that's that. sick that he's got specific Plus you can give your friends all this Let's fucking jewelry. Going. It's hot. What do you need to take? So yep. another book you can read up. I love that you can read up on these people. It gives them so much more personality. That's awesome. Yeah, that's fucking sick. That's so sick, Scarecrow. That's Where cool. is the other Cairn? I want to. F- I want to see that. You want to see the other Cairn? I want to okay. see the other Cairn. It is near Holmgstall. It's ah. it's right near. So there's another symbol again. So oh yeah, a very identifiable symbol too. I like very that. identifiable symbol. It is the tip of a penis. Very good comedy, Tyler. Just top-notch humor right there. I love it so much. You like that one, Scarecrow? We're just, we're, we're honestly just degrading ourselves to like penis poop. <laughs> we're funny. Yeah, exactly. That's how this works. Tyler, show on the map where we are right now. So near Solitude, so west of Solitude or south of like the jetty. Um, <laughs> sure. Harmigstall right here. Yep. Just northwest of it. All right, is where the Darkwood Cairn will be. I love these names too. Fuck, Scarecrow. Do these come from actual lore in the game, or is this your own written lore? Because it seems like you're kind of <gasps> writing your own lore here, and I'm I fucking love it. The Darkwood Sentinel. Fuck yes. Yeah. Damn, you took his head even though he doesn't have one. That's sick as fuck. So Put that like on. darker, slightly more greenish, and like the. Fuck yeah. I love these wooden designs that you did, Scarecrow. These Good are job. so fucking cool, Scarecrow. It's unbelievable. Because this one is like dragon bone yeah. or dragon scale mm-hmm. texture or model, but with a new texture. Yeah. That's a good looking. <laughs> this <laughs> is good. We're so, we're so little, the camera isn't like zooming in in the right spots. Scarecrow, goddamn, this is the best like armor and weaponry texture and I've so, ever seen. Yeah, like so creative and cool too. So what can we do? Is this the same stuff I we wonder. can craft here? Yeah. It's yep. Looking, yeah. Looks like it's the same stuff. Lots of wood and fetishes you can have up in here. Conjure Cairn oh, Spirit. Conjure. Ooh, so self. here's some of the new spells added. Deadly Swarm. Ooh. Attack your foe with a conjured bird of prey. I'd like that one. Um, excuse me? Yes, please. I would like that. Raptor call. Fuck yeah. Oh my god. What the fuck just happened? Hold on. Oh, it's a sound when you take out the spell. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. That what? Uh-oh. You walked literally right in front of it. That was a bad move. I, I send I sin me. Oh, Ooh. dude, fuck yeah. That what? is so Those fucking rad. feathers that come out. <laughs> That's so fucking Scarecrow, rad. that is so fucking <laughs> rad. Scarecrow. <laughs> that is so fucking sick, dude. Scarecrow, that is so fucking rad. <laughs> dude, you just get to shoot a raptor out at someone. Fly. Fly, you beautiful beast. Do my bidding. God damn it. And the, like, feather the trail, trail is feathers. the sickest shit I've ever seen. And like the the sound effect of the bird taking off. Send a raven to solitude. And just literally fucking send word at once. (laughs) Go. Fuck, I love this so much. This is, 
I'm not even mad about not being able to find the followers anymore. No. This is such you good shit. It. You cleared it for sure. Like Tori said, you can find all of these different types of animals and spirits in the wild. They have hundreds of spawn points that yes. you can find, and you'll just... It's a random encounter thing as well. You can find these two cairns, random encounters, new spells, new weapons, new armor. That's a... Tyler, that's a big fucking elk right there. Let's see if we can snipe it. Snipe it with a bird? Yes! <gasps> oh my god, this is the sickest fucking thing I've ever seen. Oh, oh what a letdown. Oh. Here we go again. Damn it! What the fuck is happening? Why does it keep doing that? Oh, it's probably because the the tracking on it is so off because of the big mod. It's the best spell. Like I've never that's the coolest. That fucking spell. animation of like the bird flying yeah. at it. That was sick. It's like some real Assassin's Creed. Oh, God, Tyler, those mammoths are enormous. And the spell is like decently it's pretty powerful. powerful. Yeah, yeah. It's like lore friendly powerful, not OP powerful. Fuck yeah. Get it, birds. Whoa. Whoa. Okay. So that's what the Sylvan Spirit is. So that here he can we, summon. Yeah, so here we go. These are these are some of the new. Um, are these? Yeah, they're enemies, right? Yeah. yeah, those are some big fucking enemies, too. Well, that's mostly because of Jurassic World. I don't know if it is. No, that's how it that's how it is in, like, the mod pictures, too. Oh, They're shit. They're big as fuck, yeah. Because these are, like, these are nature spirits. Like, they should be large, you know, intimidating protectors of... Oh, fuck. Oh, Jesus. Oh, fuck. That thing fucked us right up. No oh, shit, where'd it go? It disappeared into nature. That was sick as hell, Scarecrow. Yeah, that's Scarecrow, super that's rad. sick as fuck. Yeah, so like when you're walking around just exploring Skyrim, playing it naturally, just coming across these big sylvan spirits, these nature spirits, is going to be so much fun. There's so many enemy types. Oh, fuck. <laughs> <laughs> Blind them with birds. <laughs> boink, boink. But yeah, like as you're going as you're going about your natural play style, coming across these enemies is going to be amazing and just having that little little bit of quest of like finding all the followers, especially if you have multiple follower system, you can have, you know, all most if not all of them uh, and just being able to have their backstories. Oh, yeah, there's another spirit, right? Yep, but I think that's Oh fuck. No, they're hostile. They're coming at you. Scarecrow's are gonna tell me that are, they were the followers. Are they of mad that, that you're dude? disrupting nature? Is that what it is? Scarecrow's about to tell me that these are his. Yeah, okay, that's Holheim's spirit. But what about the ones that had the red glow? Yeah, the ones that had the red glow were maybe because I hit it with a spell, but that they could. are definitely not friendly. Well, fuck, that was so good. Scarecrow, ten out of ten. Ten out of ten. Just make the followers a little bit easier to find. And we didn't even see all of it. So once again, download it, play through it. You're going to find all of these different new enemy types, new animals in the wild, all kinds of new... F it's just fucking amazing. And then you get this rad armor, rad bird spell. That's all you need to know. Now, Rad Tyler. birds. Band name I call it? Tyler, what do you say we get on to the final mod of the day? That's a big fucking B. That is a big old B right there. Tyler, we're going to end today's episode in a place we don't come too often that's going to be white run you want to go up into the cloud district and you want to look at the farm to the left and now we want to go to that big swirling thing and enter it so go we're going right. to see right here sky life you want to open sky life that sounds like a, a either like a weird beer a yep. vape juice yep or like a lifestyle brand like oakley or something Miller Skylight, Skylight, Miller Skylife, the vape sunglasses of America. Yeah, it's just, huh. hey, thanks for coming into Skylife today, bro. Can I help you out with buying a board or something? It's definitely a longboard shop. That oh, was... Scott. Oh, fuck. Yes, it is. Yeah. So uh, how long you been boarding for? How long you been ripping the board? <laughs> It's a vape. Oh, this? This is just our in-house our, our in -house board shop vape juice that we make as well. <laughs> it's called Sky Life. Trucks are pretty loose on this. You a rook? Still? It's all right. We'll get you there, pal. <laughs> Tyler, welcome to mod number three, which is called Epic Mini Gods Player Home. And that's, pre that's pretty much all you need to know. It's, uh, it's supposed to be uh, an... an, an epic little god-like getaway from the, from the world of Skyrim. And, I mean, it's got a real... Well, number one, 
it's blooming something fierce, which I I don't. But super that's love. weird because when we came here earlier, it was not blooming. We specifically tested it and picked this mod because we didn't have the bloom issue, and now we're having the bloom issue. That's all right. We're working on it anyway. Uh, it's got a real realm of Lorcan vibe and in, in that otherworldly, like floating rock aesthetic, you know? Yep. And it's got everything you need here. It's got like the workbench, smelter, forge, like mm-hmm. all of these like tools outside that you'll need. It's got yep. a little garden. Mm-hmm. Hey, Tyler, do just do something for me quick. Yep. Just wait until evening. No, you, now you look like a real dipshit. Yeah, I look real dumb now. Didn't, that didn't help at all. But yeah, this is a cool little, like a little magical garden you got there. All, all the amenities just, you like. And you're like floating in the yeah, fucking plus sky. It, it just looks pretty fucking cool. Like that's, it's, it's cool to have like a getaway for yourself where it's like, no, this is, this is Tori's realm. No one else comes here. This is the, where I come when I need to <gasps> masturbate. The one, th- oh, 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 that's what you're using it for. Okay. Well, among other things, I also sew here. I don't want people to know that I sew. It's like girly stuff. The one thing I would say is I wish it had a fast travel point. Because uh, you do yeah. have to go to White Run yeah, yeah. and then go to this door specifically. Like you can't fast travel out as well. Right. So I wish it had a specific fast travel point, but like it looks really cool. Yeah, like it's, it's cool to be here. Yeah, it's a cool little. Let's go check out, check out the inside of the house. here. Okay, pretty modest inside here. It's got the rest of like the tools you'll need though, like yeah. alchemy and enchanting, alchemy and enchanting station. Yeah, little dinner table. Uh, just kind of, kind of a dinner table for one there, because you know, yeah. Oh my God, we look like such a little dweeb next to it. Um, mom, can do I? Do you think I could have do you, some I, of the pizza? Can I have some ice cream before I eat dinner, please? Just this once. This reminds me of a time that a child was. Uh, was over at uh, my house mm. and I had a pizza that I had specifically ordered for myself Yep, because I'm a big fan. Yep. And this child literally sat on the edge of the table uh. like this and looked at my pizza and said, that looks pretty good. It's like, yeah, it, it fucking is delicious. No, you're not having any. Oh. Did you? Know, That's what I feel like. Did you know this kid was coming over, or did they just show up and you were like, "Fuck"? No, they I showed order. up because their parents were fighting next door. No, <laughs> oh, that is the best. Uh, we've all, if you're wondering, yes, the parents did get a divorce. <clears throat> we've all been there, kiddo. <laughs> and just like this, this child came over because their parents were fighting, and then is looking at my pizza like, "My parents haven't fed me tonight because they've been too busy fighting. That pizza looks really good." <laughs> And you're like, yeah, it is, but this uh, Papa John made this for me, son. Yeah, I, that's what it was. I was like, Papa, <laughs> I knew it. Papa John made this for me. If you want to call Papa John, he'll probably make one for you if you give him money. You're like, yeah, it is pretty good. You see this body kid? You see this thick 175 body right here? This body was built by Papa John. <laughs> I got a body by John, baby. I like the little toys. Body by John. No, Tori, they're action figures. They're not to- they're not dolls. They're not the dolls. These are these are these are Skyrim Funko Pops if you want them. Oh. Tyler, there definitely is Skyrim Funko Pops probably, huh? There's like a Dragonborn be. like the typical like the one from the trailers and stuff. There's got to be. It's a very mo- like for being an otherworldly like god this is God's home. Yep. God lives mm-hmm. modestly. God God does live pretty modest. Well, I guess that would be kind of his thing right i don't know i'm not super hot on the bible <laughs> i don't think you've ever i don't think i talk about it much but i'm not super hot on that well you're you're uneducated on it you're not it's, you're not well versed in the bible yeah well it's just yeah that's that's probably why i'm a non-believer oh, anyway looks hey. like a big pizza can i have so yeah real modest house it's got the cool little like kind of trinkets on the top and it, it does have what you need but I don't, god i don't know i mean it'd be pretty dope to have a palace in the sky there imperial agent Imperial agent, it'd be pretty sick to have a palace in the sky. Hey, Imperial agent, fucking cut out that shit intro you have on YouTube, please. Please, it's not even yours. It's not even yours. You just took it from someone else, and it's like 45 seconds long. No one wants to watch it. Please. This is, I like this home. It's modest, (laughs) but it's modest. The the location is cool. I wish you could fast travel to it, and I... Maybe a I little could, bit more. Maybe could, a little bit more beef. I I could use a little more beef in the house. I could use uh maybe like a, a dad's nasty bath. Mm. Just like so put a nice hot tub for when God likes to soak his nasty bits. You know mm-hmm. they get filthy doing that kind of work. 
Yeah. I mean, I'm sure he wasn't guy. clean after he flooded the world, you know? No, his hands weren't clean. He had a lot of blood on his hands then. He he sure did. But the, the exterior is really cool. The floating rock kind of realm of Lorcan-like exterior is real cool. Mm-hmm. Let's check it out once more. Okay, so now the bloom is gone. So we can get a better look at it. Oh, hey, that's kind of cool. Those little oh. floating little like mage light things. Yeah. It looks and cool. And the bloom here. is back. We looked into the sky Great. and the bloom is back. Love it. Beautiful. Well, it looks, you, it you looks probably cool. probably won't have the bloom issue. That's that's definitely us. Uh, but I do I do like it. There's it's not perfect and there could be I it has such a grandeur to the exterior. I'd like the interior to be uh, a little bit more there, but all in all, it's a pretty fun mod if you just want to have a little getaway from Skyrim. Yeah, and the ideal getaway. I really did like Sylvan Spirits, though. I fuck Scarecrow. That's some good shit. Scarecrow, that was good shit. You know what? You think birds can fly in space? We're going to make them fly, baby. They can. Tyler, what do you say we take flight out of this episode? Thank you so much for tuning in to another episode of Shapeless Skyrim. If you have any mods you'd like to suggest, you can do so on Twitter. I will be at Lurking Lion. I will be at Subtly Cool, or you can contact all of us at Shapeless Media on Twitter. Okay. You can find our community tab on YouTube, or yep. the best place to get a hold of us, that comment section. You want to goof? You want to leave a review for one of the mods? You yep. want to suggest some more mods? comment section baby if you're scarecrow and you want to help people find those other followers you can do that in the comments as well scarecrow please scarecrow, please, please please do that please, please tell me where they are because i want to find them i want to find them scarecrow so if you could let us know where those extra followers are scarecrow fuck that was so good yeah you scarecrow, knocked it out of the park that was that was a 10 out of 10 mod right we're there. kind of just talking to you now scarecrow hey, scarecrow hey, you did a fantastic job buddy and hey, you, really, uh, you, you know really i'm honored to have you as a friend of the show and um if uh, you could make a mod where we're in it please now you're just begging. I'm now it's sad. You're look, just begging. It's been years, and I just really, I just really want to be in the you game. You gotta die in order to be in the game. Surely, surely, old grandma lady isn't isn't dead yet, and she's going in it. Yet. Yeah. <laughs> Todd's gonna kill her before. <laughs> I'm just saying, better watch out, Shirley. <laughs> so, uh, just to touch on that community tab again. Last week we did kind of a vote thing, like, hey, do you want to see a one mod deep dive? Do you want to see whatever? I'm kind of play with ideas of ways to like include you guys more in how we how we structure the show maybe maybe get you involved in what mods we showcase or what you want to see from the showcase or anything like that so be going like to the community tab and just checking seeing what we got on there because hopefully i will be better at using it i'm really working on that and if you're subscribed to shirley curry why don't you go ahead and unsubscribe go ahead and just unsubscribe from that Go ahead and unsubscribe from her. No reason for you to be watching her content. It fucking sucks. Let's let me, get that out of the way. Let me tell you what. She she aped our concept and is doing the... She stole our fucking concept and does it way worse. She does it shitty and also has a lot... She calls, hey, grandkids. It's like some... Shirley literally, and we know this for a fact, because we asked Shirley to be a part of one of the videos, and she said no, and then she took the idea and started doing it. Are you fucking kidding me? This old fucking <laughs> ripped our content. She just totally aped our game right there. And, and we're not talking, we're the, the storyteller series, she's just like, I'm going to no, do that, but lazy. I'm going to do that, but badly with this sh All right. We, we've I feel like we've dunked on Shirley enough. No, no, <laughs> we have never dunked on Shirley enough because she's a fucking <laughs> She fucking she bit off our goddamn game. Thank, <laughs> you, thank <laughs> you for watching. <laughs> go go harass Shirley online. I'm going to see. Do we have that power? Can no, we, send we absolutely don't. Go harass Shirley online. She's got like a million and a half subscribers. They go will fucking go fucking harass her. They will ruin us. <laughs> yeah, they will. They'll get us canceled. Wait, what is she gonna do? She was pro she probably used. <laughs> look, I'll be honest. If it comes to it, I'll. <laughs> if it comes to it, look. If we do a deep enough dive, Shirley's probably. <laughs> and so we have that in our back pockets. True. So we win, Shirley. We have the high ground. Go harass Shirley. <laughs> let's see what kind of power. We, let's see what kind of clout we got online. Fuck. T, thank you for watching. We'll see you next week. We don't actually mean that. Please don't do that. Don't.
Now, okay, don't do it. Don't do it. You get a good mix of kiddos in there. That wasn't a good sentence that you just said right there. 